dear learners today using uh, ibm watson studio i'm going to demonstrate image classification using the services available in ibm watson studio so already i have created my ibm cloud account after uh, logging into the ibm cloud account we have to launch the visual recognition service that can be identified from this menu catalog if we go and search we will get visual recognition service so once we launch the service that the environment will be coming like this the screen what you are viewing that will be available then you have to uh, launch the watson studio right so once you launch You will get this place only with the first these two boxes. Create a class and a negative box, right? So here the image classification. What I am going to perform is for uh, pneumonia infected uh, chest X-rays. So using that I am going to classify uh, the X-ray images uh, having uh, a normal chest as well as the X-ray images having the pneumonia infected chest. So both we are going to classify. So I have taken the images from this website. So from the gaggle.com, I have taken the, <coughs> here you could be able to see, chest x-ray, test folder, train folder, validation folder. From this training folder, I'm having the normal x, the normal directory, that means the x-rays uh, which are having normal chest without any diseases okay so this is going to be used for the class first class right so this normal x-rays are being uploaded in the first one normal chest okay normal chest so second class is pneumonia chest so in that I have uploaded from the same website from the same website we go back so there is a folder called it sorry there is a folder called it pneumonia within that uh, we will be having set of images that you will be able to see here showing pneumonia so within this pneumonia i am having set of images so those images are being uploaded in this pneumonia chest after uploading these two things so we can upload as a direct zip file you could be able to see here i have uploaded a pneumonia chest.zip normal chest.zip using this browse button we have to upload these two files by default it is enough to upload as a zip file by default that will be treated as images and once if we uploaded all the images uh, this button will get enabled since already i have trained the, the button got disabled okay so once all these images are being uploaded just you click this train model so once if you are going to click this train model button it will start to show you time elapsed in seconds so that time that it will take to train the model here the model that what we are going to use is the built-in model that are available for this okay so once the training is over once the training is over we will get a message your model is ready click here to view the model so click here that that link will be the hyperlink so you have to press here in that uh, link once you click this this window will open right so this is the name that i have given for the corresponding project just pneumonia classifier right that you could be able to see here just pneumonia classifier using that name only i have launched this project okay so now my model is ready to classify right if i want to use in my external uh, environment i have to use this uh, id right this model id i could be able to use so how to test the model right here i could be able to upload a image and i could be able to use it Otherwise, if you want to use it through programming, here all the code snippets are available. So if I am going to use it in Java, 
So what I have to use? So I have to use that API key. So API key can be accessed from my Watson service, right? So in the first window that we could able to see that I'm having the API key. So through that you could able to access it. Overview there, you want it? So model ID. So using that API key for the some service that you could able to get it. Yeah, this is the API key which will help me to uh, execute my environment without logging into the corresponding programs. Again, no need to train and no need to involve in further processes. Okay. So directly I could able to supply image and I could able to check it. So now I'm going to check it out, right? So already uh, I have downloaded uh, downloaded here image consists of pneumonia. The image consists of pneumonia. Uh, check this. This is an image which is uh, being downloaded from the validation directory. Right? It is getting loaded. See that pneumonia chest. 0.92. So it is telling confidently that the X-ray what we have uploaded uh, is being infected with uh, pneumonia, right? And uh, to prove that, you could able to see here the chest X-ray under validation directory. We get into that pneumonia. The first image only I have used, right? So it is the uh, proved that the model is working well and good, right? So this is the way to perform image classification using Watson Studio, IBM Watson Studio. And uh, the case study, what we have involved here is just pneumonia classification. Thank you. Happy learning.